Today, I'm going to explain an American supernatural crime thriller movie, Death Note, released in the year 2017. The movie is about a boy, Light, who receives a mysterious notebook which causes the death of anyone whose name is mentioned on it and Light uses it for the betterment of the world but things don't go as planned. But before we begin to tell you the story, please subscribe to our channel, as we really need your support to grow and sustain making these amazing recaps. The movie opens with a college boy named Light sitting beside the ground, where he is keeping an eye on a girl, Mia Sutton. After a while, Mia notices Light, and when she is about to approach him, it starts raining, so she has to leave. Before Light can run away, he notices a book falling from the sky with Death Note written on it. On his way, Light encounters a boy named Kenny while bullying a freshie with his friends. At the same time, Mia arrives and starts fighting with the bullies, but Light interferes and gets knocked out by Kenny. In the following scene, Light is in the principal's office, who informs him that they have found the homework of around 15 students in his bag, but Light asks him to punish Kenny for making life difficult for others. The principal ignores him and mentions they found him unconscious after hitting his head on a log. When Light insists, the principal calms him by stating that his mother's accidental demise has affected him and punishes Light with two weeks of detention. Light is sitting in the detention room when he opens the death note and reads rule number one, indicating that the name of the human written on this notebook shall die. Suddenly, Light hears a noise, and upon checking, he rushes back after looking at a mysterious creature. The mysterious creature messes up the detention room and stops Light from leaving the room. Light slaps himself, thinking he is sleeping, but the mysterious creature approaches him to ensure he is not dreaming. The mysterious creature suggests Light either keep the notebook or leave it alone for one week so that he may find someone else to own the book. The mysterious creature then diverts Light's attention to Kenny and states that he knows what Light wants to do. The mysterious creature gives a pen to Light, and after he finishes writing Kenny's name, the mysterious creature requests him to write how he wants to see him dead. Light writes decapitation for Kenny's death, and as he puts down the pen, the things are set up so that Kenny's head explodes. Light is thrilled after witnessing the incident, and the mysterious creature asks him to decide whether he wants to keep the book. Light is having dinner with his father, James Turner, at night when he gets into an argument about letting go of his mother's killer, Anthony Scomall. Light angrily leaves the table and starts reading the death note rules. He notices that the mysterious creature is named, Ryuk and the book suggests being careful about him. Light finds Ryuk in the dark and questions whether he can control people before their deaths, and Ryuk informs him that he cannot control them, but they can affect their lives for two days before they die. Ryuk asks Light not to discuss the rules and regulations with him while they can do so much good for the world. Light thinks of an idea and writes the name and method for Antony's death, while Ryuk tells him that the name and picture of the victim are all he needs to work. Antony is in a hotel when he dies by impaling himself accidentally. The next day, James comes to see Light in his room and reveals the news of Antony's death to him. When asked, James tells Light he is unwillingly happy about Antony's death while Light apologizes for misbehaving with him. After that, Light is in college when Mia approaches him, and when he mentions his detention, Mia apologizes. Mia then questions Light about Kenny, and he replies that he has seen his head exploding, to which Mia gets interested to know how Kenny died. Light leads her to a room where he shows her the death note and explains everything, but Mia does not believe him. Light accesses a live crime scene and finds a man named Broad, who has held his wife hostage. Light writes his name and how he dies in the death note, and Mia is taken aback after realizing that Light is true. That evening, Light informs Mia that he wants to help the people feel the same joy he has felt, and Mia appreciates his decision and assures him that she will be with him. Mia and Light spend time together and select criminals to kill next. Light starts a chain of killings and selects Kira as a name for himself, which means Light in Russian and Killer in Japanese. Light and Mia keep targeting many criminals by accessing the criminal database using James's account. The media and public acknowledge Kira's services, and a certain group considers themselves as followers. Following that, Light becomes concerned for his father and asks him the reason for not letting him know that he is working on Kira's investigation. James leaves, stating that he was also unsure until his authorities confirmed it. James returns to his office and receives a call from his boss, who tells him that they have been ordered to inform him that someone else with authority's approval will help him in this case and will contact him soon. As the call ends, a man named Watry approaches James and tells him that he works for the one who has made it clear that the idea of Kira being related to the police is not just an idea but a fact. When asked, Watry informs that the predictor is named L and wants to talk to James. James talks to L on a call and complains to him to contact the FBI and CIA instead of him 
but L assures him that no one has a better understanding of the potential suspects other than him. L also reveals that the name Kira is an intentional misdirection while Kira is in Seattle. On the other hand, Mia shows a website she has designed to target criminals, but Light tells her that they cannot kill anyone without a proper criminal record about him. Watry leads James to L, they find each other differently than they had thought. James then reveals that he collected all the information about the suspect by himself because most of his co-workers consider Kira, their hero. L asks James to sit and shows him that Broad was Kira's first victim and shows his relation to a police database. L adds that he has the records of every police officer who has access to the database. L then leaves, stating that he wants to start by talking to Kira. Mia contacts Light and asks him to watch TV. Light watches the news and comes across L's press conference in which he informs everyone that Kira is a man, not an omnipotent power, and he has been charged with the murders of more than 400 people. L challenges Kira to kill him on live TV, but nothing happens to him. As L returns, James gets mad at him for doing this all. L replies that he has a theory that Kira needs a name and a face to kill someone, and if he is right or wrong, they will get important information about him. Light finds his father at night and asks him about L but James tells him that he is unaware of his real name. All the information Light can get from his father is the name of L and his assistant Watari. The following day, Light senses being tailed, and James gets mad at L for setting a man behind his son and leaves after telling if he needs any information regarding his son, L can contact him. After that, Mia and Light are together when Light suggests going quiet for a few days, but Mia opposes the idea and keeps insisting on killing the officers following them. Light opposes both Ryuk and Mia and thinks that the book belongs to him. After a few days, Mia and Light are together watching TV, and Mia leaves after listening to the news that Kira has disappeared for a few days since the police challenged him, and the crimes are also increasing. The next day, the director of the police department, Pearl, passes out due to a heart attack, and as the news reaches L, he contacts Agent Franks and asks him to withdraw his team. But it's too late, and Franks and his other team members commit suicide. Light gets mad at Ryuk, thinking he is responsible for the deaths, but he tells him he is not the puppy that will follow him, and he has already suggested him to throw away the death note if he cannot handle it. Light tells him he is not going to give the death note to anyone else. Mia and Light are suddenly taken aback after listening to James's press conference in which he declares Kira a criminal and challenges to kill him while El and Watari keep waiting in the crowd. Mia loses her mind and is about to write James's name in the book, but Light stops her and asks her to leave. Following that, L and Watari meet James and appreciate him for risking his life. They wait to let Kira decide what to do, but nothing happens. James returns home, and Light hugs him for returning safely. Light then leaves after telling his father he is proud of him when James gets busy with L's call. On the other hand, L tells Watari that Light is Kira and approaches Light while sitting in a cafe. Light pretends to barely recognize him while L informs him that he knows he is Kira and it would have been difficult for him to let his father live. Light is about to leave, but he spots Ryuk there and decides to talk to L. Light suggests him to help Kira instead of arresting him because he is helping the weak people. It infuriates L, and he tells him his job is to bring people to justice, and Light leaves after watching L's face and getting into an argument with him. Light returns home and finds Mia waiting for him. Light ignores her, but she confesses her love, and Light takes her inside after revealing that he has seen L's face and they will continue work. Light writes Watari's name on the death note and makes him obsessed with revealing L's identity for the next 48 hours. Light explains to Mia that he is not going to kill Watari because the book allows him to save one life by burning the page, but Ryuk mentions that they have only one chance to do and they will have to face the consequences if they get the wrong name. Watari contacts Light and informs him that this information may be present in old records of Winchester wards which is the place to train the world's greatest detectives, and L joined it at the age of 7 years. Light orders him to get the information within 48 hours, and Watari continues his journey to find it. Meanwhile, L realizes something is wrong with Watari and confirms it after visiting his house. Light, Mia, and James are having dinner together when L visits them and blames Light for being Kira. Meanwhile, Mia leaves after listening to their conversation, and after she leaves, James gets mad at L for blaming his son. L orders his men to tear the place apart to get the required information about Light. The police check everything, but they don't find any clue, after which Light also realizes that the book is gone. The next day, Mia informs him that she has the book. Later that night, Mia and Light attend a dance party where Light replaces himself with another man to dodge the officer following him and rushes towards the book. At the same time, he receives a call from Watari, 
who proclaims to reach the abandoned building of the orphanage and will inform Light about El's real name shortly, but he has very little time. When Watari discovers El's real name and is about to inform Light, Watari is shot down and killed. On the other hand, when Light tries to save Watari, he learns that the page with Watari's name on it is missing. Light returns to Mia, who explains that she is the one who has taken out the page and she is also responsible for the deaths of all detectives following Light earlier. We come to know that Mia has become greedy for the death note and informs Light she has written his name on the book, which will cause his heartbeat to stop at midnight. She tells him that after Light gives her the book, she will burn his page and save him. On the other side, L becomes mad after Watari's death and leaves to arrest Light. L finds Light and follows him. When L is about to capture Light, a chef appears there, and L asks the man to help catch Kira, but the chef knocks him instead because he is one of the followers of Kira. After that, Light leads Mia to the Ferris wheel, where he asks her not to touch the book if she loves him. Mia claims to love him more than the book at first, but then she snatches the book from Light when he gets distracted to find his father there. After the book is snatched, Light informs Mia that he has written her name in the book and she will be killed if she touches it. Now that Mia and Light are destined to die, Ryuk appears there and creates a scenario that causes Mia to fall and die on the ground. On the other hand, Light falls into the water when his page gets detached and burnt in the fire. After that, a man saves Light and spends some time in a comma. Light reopens his eyes when a man places the death note on his chest. After Light has hidden the book, James visits his son and questions whether L was right about him. Light admits that he is Kira and explains to him how he selected a doctor to save him after the fall into the water and how he managed to keep the series of murders continued despite being in comma. He gets sad, mentioning how he wrote Mia's death after the page with Light's name is burnt. Subsequently, L is fired from his job and is about to leave Seattle when he recalls what Light said to him. L rushes to Mia's house, where he finds the names of all the detectives who died on a page of the death note. L gets confused while writing someone's name on it. At the same time, Light notices Ryuk, who claims that the humans are very interesting, and the movie ends here. Overall Death Note is a great movie to watch with an amazing storyline, so make sure to check it out. To watch many more exciting recaps like this. Don't forget to subscribe as that's the only way we can keep making these fantastic recaps and like this video. Let us know in the comments section about your next favorite movie that you would like us to recap. Thanks again for watching and stay safe and healthy.